fostering closer ties on the high seas. This Chinese naval fleet docked here in the mother city and in traditional style, the Cape of Storms playing two to its name. But not even the bad weather could dampen the mood as South African naval officials and government delegates were welcomed on board for an official tour marking the reception on one of the ships. The fleet has been on a long voyage, passing through a number of ports, with the Cape being its final. South Africa is the last leg of the eight African nation tour for Chinese Navy's 16th escort task group to visit. Uh, and also this is the third time for Chinese Navy to visit South Africa. The Chinese naval fleet comprises of three vessels, which include modern frigates and a supply ship. They've also been actively participating in a number of sorties, including escorting batches of the surrendered Syrian chemical weapons. China and South Africa already have a strategic relationship through BRICS, and both navies also contribute to regional security stability. We do uh, have naval cooperation right away up front, whether it will be part of the BRICS construct or uh, whatever, who knows, we will follow the political lead. But the reality is that the South African Navy uh, has a very nice warm handshake with the Chinese Navy. Yeah, I think we can find synergies most definitely with people with the Chinese Navy when they come here. Uh, when we both meet in anti-piracy operations uh, off SADC waters uh, towards the Horn of Africa. The arrival of the fleet has not only drawn the interest from local Navy officials, but also from the local Chinese community. We also got the opportunity to get a peek of what's been called the pride of the nation. The Chinese Naval Escort Task Group has been at sea for over six months now and running the trip to the Cape of fitting into their mammoth voyage. For their South African counterparts, this was a great opportunity to further strengthen already existing close cooperation and further promotion of common interests between the two navies. That was Andrew, CCTV, Cape Town.